How do magnets attract? We will explore this question in this video. Hmm. How can it work? What makes it attract? What makes it repel? What does famous physicist Richard Feynman have to say about this? If you get hold of two magnets and you push them, you can feel this pushing between them. Turn it around the other way and, it, and they slam together. Now, what is it, the feeling between those two magnets? He can only answer. So I'm not going to be able to give you an answer to why magnets attract each other, except to tell you that they do. Not a very satisfying answer. Even the insane clown posse in their video, Miracles, wants to know how magnets work. I see miracles all around me. Stop and look around, it's all astounding. Water, fire, air, and dirt. F***ing magnets, how do they work? And I don't want to talk to a scientist. Yo, m is lying and getting me pissed. So why is it so difficult to answer this simple question? Well, I will give you the answer in this video. And I will do it without using any math and using only common textbook physics. The secret is in how old TVs worked. You remember the old TVs? Inside these TVs was a big picture tube. It shot electrons from the back and they hit the screen in front. Normally they would go straight ahead, but coils wrapped around the tube created magnetic fields. Bzz, bzz. The secret is that when an electron passes by a magnetic field, it is attracted towards that magnetic field. And the beam is deflected up and down depending on the direction of the magnetic field, and this drew the picture on the screen. So what does this have to do with how magnets work? Well, a bar magnet is like a piece of iron which is wrapped with loops of wires. Electrons fly around these loops going round and round. These moving electrons are similar to the electrons being shot from the back of a TV screen. So what do you suppose happens to these electrons if you put them in a magnetic field? The electrons are attracted upward toward the magnet, like they are in the TV. And since they cannot escape the magnet, the electrons drag the rest of the magnet up. So first the electron current heads up, then it drags the rest of the magnet with it. That is the secret for how magnets really work. What you are feeling is the effect of all the electrons pushing against the atoms of the magnet as they are attracted to the magnetic field. Let's put it another way. Suppose you had two bird cages and I put a bird feeder between them. This will cause the birds to be attracted to the feeder and they'll run up against their cage and actually drag their cages toward the feeder. This is like an attraction. Now, if you put a vicious kitty cat there, wow! then they'll be repelled and they'll drag their cages away in a repulsion. So, what are we feeling when two magnets attract? We're just feeling the electrons pushing against the magnet as they are attracted towards the magnetic field. This is just like the birds pushing their cage. This is really a fairly straightforward application of what is known as the Lorentz force law for you physics types. There you have it, the answer to how magnets attract. Magnets attract because of the electrons pushing their way towards the other magnet. It's that simple. And why is this important? Well, computers, cell phone, and cars, and just about every sophisticated technology that we have relies on magnets. By knowing that it's the electrons that are doing the pushing, we might be able to engineer better magnets. This only barely scratches the surface of how magnets work. To learn more, visit www.howdomagnetsattract.com